Looking for the best in African entertainment? The African Movie Revolution is on at AparivoMovies.com. If you enjoy action, adventure, romance, comedy, horror, <laughs> suspense and drama, musicals and family films, visit AparivoMovies.com where you'll find premium African movies in all these genres and in all these languages. English, French, Swahili, Yoruba, Lingala, Hausa, and Twi at AfarivoMovies.com. The African movie revolution is on. The king has gone to the land beyond, leaving the throne to the two of you. This is not a time to make enemies, but to come together and be strong. Divided we fall, united we stay. Let's come together as one family. Somebody help me ask them what they're fighting for. What are the real and fighting for? Who has the tiger here? Somebody help me and ask this two brothers. What are you really fighting for? Who has the tiger here? God did not make a mistake at all. Brought your brother to the world before you. Don't try to kill. Ogene, okay, what is it? Ogene, okay, Ogene. Okay. I am having a sharp pain on my shoulder. L let me rest a bit. What? Who is that sluggard? Will you carry on immediately before I change my mind? You fool. Yes. Move! Move! Forgive me. Forgive me. Princess, forgive me. Princess. Papa, please. Beg her for me. Come and beg her for me. Princess. Princess, come back. Princess. Princess, come back, please. Why did you throw the princess off the cart? You wanted to kill her? Please, Your Highness, I will... Shut up! Please. I don't want to see him again in my whole life. Hell! Jay! Your Highness, please, have mercy. Please, please, have mercy. Hell! Hell! Please. 
You have been banished from this village. Jay! Jay! Help! Please! Please help me, Your Highness. Please! Please! How are you? I know how you feel. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. I know how you feel. The gods of this land will protect you as you go on your way. But don't you worry. One day you will come back to this your land, your father's land. Don't worry. But what is my sin? I have served the king and his daughter all these years. Very well. Just a little mistake, a little mistake. Don't you worry. Go. May the gods of the land protect you as you go. that happened. Yes, my sister. I did not do anything more than that. You have no problem. I will talk to the king. My husband. He will give you a place to live in the palace. Thank you, sister. Thank you. You can take your things to my apartment. from a luku under my roof. It will strain my relationship with my friend, King Okeke. More so, my days are strictly numbered. I do not intend to leave any discord for my children after I have joined my ancestors. My lord, please find somewhere else. Your Highness, 
Please. Please. You know he's my brother. Assist him. Please. I have said it. I cannot go back on it. Okay, go behind. Wait in my apartment. I will play with him later. He will give you where to stay. anything troubling you, please explain to the king. He will listen to you. Your Highness, we call the king and the living, defending themselves. Yes! Yes! yes. Not so only that, Your Highness. They have also defied our farmland. Yes! 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 What is your name? Good night, Your Highness. A new young woman. Elebe, Your Highness. You have heard what they said. Is it true? If you can, now, Your Highness, I warn him. Your Highness, I was only... Quiet. What happens to a man who sleeps with another man's wife in this village? He will be made to dance naked, Your Highness. Amadou yes. Ken. Yes. Igwe. He knows the custom of this land. Yes. Take them away and execute the punishment. <laughs> Where is your wife? She's here, Father. No. I'm calling and your wife. Father, she's here. Yeah. As you all can see, age and time are no longer on my side. Anything can happen at any time. I've called you to remind you that this royal family has been handling the affairs of this village peacefully. Akuna. Yes, Father. You are my first son. You know what the tradition says. You can only succeed me on the throne on provision of a lion's head after my demise. It is an uphill task, but as my ancestors aided me in my days, so we will take care of you. It is a task that must be done. Whilst on the throne, 
your wife, mother, brother, stepmother, and your brother's wife will be as one. No discrimination. This Helen identifies you as my first son. Yes, Father. Present it to the village on the day of coronation. It is an ancestral card. If you do not present it, you may be doubted as the heir presumptive. Guru. Yes, Father. As the second son, you must always be by your brother. Yes, Father. Remember, you are his next of kin. You have always fared for one another. You will always give him unflinching support whenever he needs you. Always wear this on your left wrist. Make sure you do not misplace it. Yes, Father. Because in any circumstance where a corner cannot perform, you can only take his place on presentation of this angle. And you women, Notwithstanding Akuna's age, you must always give him the same respect as you have shown me. But, Your Highness, what if Akuna cannot provide the lion's head as tradition stipulates? If the first son cannot provide the lion's head. One month after the red machete is handed over to him, the second son takes over the mandate. The first son, therefore, forfeits his hereditary right. If the second son could not meet up the three months deadline, the throne becomes vacant. Any other person who brings the lion's head becomes the king. Throughout the history of this family, it has not been heard that the first son could not meet up with this essential. If it happens in your own time, the shame will be yours. It will not happen, Father. I know it will not happen. My ancestors will guide you. I have heard you, Father. Your Highness, you know it is not an easy task to hunt and kill a lion. How do I go about it? The glory of your ancestors will overtake you. And my spirit will always guide you. Thank you, Father. Like I said, I will take care of that as soon as I come back. But for now, I have to go for the burial. Take care of everything. Okay. Bye-bye. All right.
Get out of my house, oh. Get out of my house before I shout. What? You know it is an abomination to sleep with your brother's wife, but you want to sleep with me. So that when my husband becomes king, you go about the village saying you, you slept with his wife. Eh? No. Okay, please get out of my house before I shout. Eh? Okay, get out. I will shout, okay? No, don't shout. Don't, don't tell the I'm telling you. Okay. You don't try it. No! No! What is it? What's the matter? Nothing. Okay. Oh, you are here. Yes. Okay. Uh, every time a crow will come here to disturb me, I don't know what his problem is. So. No, I okay. just saw my brother off and decided to come and say hello to the wife. That's all. Okuro, yeah. you saw your brother off and you decided to come and say hello to his wife. Okoro. Now get out. Just get out. I said you should get out of here. Did you hurt me? No. Okay. Is that the story? Ah, where's you look worried. The great Iroko has fallen. What? Hey! What? The lion himself is no more. Hey! So we are in for the search of another tiger head. Yes. King Godun is passed on to his ancestors this afternoon. Hmm. Ah! Hmm. I have sent messengers to gather all the elders. But Martin Dulwe, you must come with me to the palace immediately. I hear you. I hear you. You may figure me. I'll meet you there. Hey! Martin Dulwe, I'll meet you there. ancestors. We also know what our custom says when a king has passed on, his body must see the earth before the moon rises. The funeral rites are on. They shall continue until the soul apparent to the throne presents to us the head of a lion or a tiger. In the meantime, the sole regent to the royalty, Mazin Dulue, will have to protect our custom and traditions until Akuna procures and presents to us the head of a lion or a tiger to claim the throne of his palace. We shall meet again when the body of our late king must have been laid to rest for further deliberations. Ekenamon. Nde, 
I am one. Have you seen the happiness and pride Ugoma and Ezi are displaying? Just because Akuna is to become king. <sighs> I have my daughter. And I feel hurt. How I wish I can change this useless tradition. How I wish I can change this tradition. Nah. Mm. Mom. You know your son, my husband, Okuro can still become king. All hopes are not lost. Try and talk to him. He is so hardly any different about the situation. I have been thinking about it myself, my daughter. You know, Ugoma has always looked down on me. If her son is eventually crowned king, She will become something else. Welcome, my husband. Is my food ready? Yes. Do you want it now? Yes. My son, the lion. Mm -hmm. Take your seat. I want to talk to you. Talk and wait, ma'am. I want food. I'm hungry. My son. Food should not be your main problem. You should rather think of propelling yourself. Propelling myself? Over what? I don't understand. I want you to take up the mantle of leadership. I want you to become king. Is that why I should not have my food? My son. Be serious for once. Do you know you can still be in the forefront of events? <laughs> that is a dream joke, Mama. My elder brother is still alive. I cannot take his birthplace. <laughs> what if Akuna did not come up with the tiger set? Never! That has never happened in the history of my family. And it will never happen in my time. My lord, can't you be ambitious for once? Fair for the kingship. And I will help you. Don't speak abomination. Watch your tongue, woman! My son, your wife is right. You can still become king, and that will be my greatest pleasure. Nay, um, um, every individual belongs to a family, and family interest must therefore be paramount to individual goals, if the family must continue to exist. If I begin to wish the lion's head elude my brother, how am I sure I will get it? Any mischief reduces the chances of this family being in control. Akunna Udenze shall be king. And I, Udumeze, Okoro Udenze, will operate from the corridor of power. Let's not talk about it. This is not a time to make enemies, but to come to. Our tradition demands that our king be buried with a tiger head. I vow. We are gathered here today to present the weapon in search of the tiger head to our late king's next of kin. 
Yeah. 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 Come out and receive the authority, the power, the fearlessness and deserve to go forth and do what you must before you become king. Here. Here, with the spirits of our ancestors and your father just gone beyond, take the spectre. It will be your fourth and guiding force towards your enthronement. Your family has been known for its valor and chivalry. They have always led this village to great expeditions. They have always proven their worth when it comes to looking for the tiger's head. Oh, yeah. My son. Today is your turn. This sword has never been removed from the first son and given to the second son. But, but if you, out of fear, cowardice, or inability to find the tiger's head, and you fail, this sword will be taken from you and given to your younger brother. Yeah. So, my son, as you go on, May the spirits of Allah guide and protect you. He said, I can hear more. Amudo, Wolu, yeah. Wolu, yeah. Zwolu, yeah. Where's Wolu? Yeah. Wolu, yeah. Wolu, yeah. Wolu, yeah. Yeah. Wolu, yeah. Wolu, I said, Man is Okoro. You don't look yourself. Akuna, what is it? Okoro, what is the matter? Okoro, I'm warning you. Keep away from my wife. Leave my wife alone. When you met my brother, I would show you what they do to wife Jesus. You know very well it's an abomination to go after someone else's wife in this village, and yet you do it. What's more, of all the women in this village, it's my own wife that you've picked upon. Okoro, Okoro! But for the death of her father, and the fact that I am now head of this family, I would have shown you the other side of me. But I am warning you, he who rides a tiger will never dismount. Keep away from my wife. What is it, Rati? Eh? Don't I have a wife? Oh, oh, oh. What is it that the wife has? A marriage lies. Huh? Just because I... Huh? Mama, imagine the insult. Didn't I tell you? Didn't I tell you? You have just started seeing the real person in our corner. This is just the beginning. Just wait. Let our corner get the lion thing. Then you will know you're nothing. You now realize that you are alone. You have only stood by your brother, Akuna. But because he wants to become king, he now treats you like a slave. He wants you out of the way by every means. See what length he has now gone to paint you ill. I can see clearly now. This action by my brother is a premonition of worse things to come. I will do anything possible to defect his getting a lion's head. His right to eat is just because of his death position. We are both of royal blood. Let the worst come. I will be king. 
You are now behaving like a royal blood. Since you are ready to get to the throne, I will help you. And let the world go. Oh. I will. You must conceal your desires. And pretend as if you are doing everything possible to help Akona get the tiger's head. Change allegiance to him. But do everything possible to make him fail. Even if at last he gets the tiger's head, make sure the information did not come to light. We have other What are the plans? Please. Do you think I've got that for you? See, something has already eaten deep into this, into this one. It is not spoiled. Go and prepare them. Eh? Maybe we could use them for dinner tonight. Mm. Should I cook the two of them? Yes, cook the two so that it will be enough for everybody. Okay. Eh? Mm. Uh -huh. uh, Koro. Koro. You're welcome. Uh -huh. Thank you. How is the day? I'm fine. Uh, I can. I came to apologize for what happened the other day. I promise it won't happen again. Oh, darling. 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 Such a thing should never happen between us. Remember, Father said we should be each other's keeper. Yes. It's all right, I've forgiven you. Thank you for the understanding. Um, by the way, when and where are you going for the lion's head? I'll be leaving for the Olori Forest tomorrow morning. That is where the elders have directed me to go to. I will stay there day and night till I succeed. Akun, I shall go with you. You will? Yes. I mean, it will be easy and safer for two people to get a lion's head and one. Um, you're, you're correct. You're correct. Uh, uh, okay. That's, that's very kind of you. That's that's very kind of you. That's that's very kind of Warriors of Amudu, thank you for escorting us. From this point onwards, we shall go it on our own. But I promise you one thing, I shall return with the lion's head. May the spirit of our forefathers be with you. You say, I'm going to go to Quenu. 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 
What are you saying, Okoro? That after wasting one whole week in this place, after all the suffering, you want us to go back empty-handed? What about the lion's head? We must not kill ourselves because of the lion's head. Look, I have a friend who can provide you a lion. No! No, no, no! It has never been heard that our father or his forebears got a lion's head from somebody. Besides, whatever lion's head we get has to be fresh. Look, Okoro, if you want to go back on your own and you feel that you can do it, that's fine by me. I have barely three weeks to go, and I will not leave this forest without the lion's head. my lord father of my husband in your time you were a very successful man a very strong one now you have gone to join your ancestors and we believe that your spirit guides and protects us from there It's been two weeks since I could have my husband went to the Lori forest in search of a tiger head. It is a very dangerous forest. But we believe your spirit will guide and protect it. Oh, do say, my lord, please protect him. Bring him back alive. Show him the game that he so he can pay the tribute. Show him the tiger head. And when he is king, let his people love and respect him. Let his rule be a golden one. Uduze the great. Showed love and mercy when you were with us. Please show us more love and mercy now that you are in the spiritual spheres. Oh, do me, my Lord. Please hear my cry. Just one more week to provide the lion's head. I have to intensify my search. 
That does not mean you should not eat. Hmm? You survive today to see tomorrow. If your interest is food, take. Take. warrior of Amudo, do not allow me to be disgraced. Show me the lion's path that I may be able to complete your final funeral rites in order to give you a befitting burial like you did for your own father before you. Do not let me down. Do not let me down. What was that? <laughs> I'm only testing your likeness to kill a liar. Don't you ever try that again. Do you hear me? Let's go. They are not the son of the lion. What are you still doing there? Then hurry up.
Coming dangerous. Let us go, 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 Ha, ha, ha. 
have you just done? Because it's intentional. It's a lot of joy. Please. If I don't find my lion's head, I will cut off your own head. No, no, we'll find it. If we can't find it, we'll go with the body. They will see that. I don't want any body. I want my lion's head. We will find it. We'll, we'll go with the body. They will see that we'll kill a lion if we go with the body. Have you found it? This is not a time to make enemies, but to count. Also, who calls? Ah, uh, all Java, the peace lover. <laughs> sit down, sit down. Sit down. Has the prince brought back the lion head? No. The delayance is causing anxiety. I fear for the mother. Oh. She's now a living corpse. Just one week, the red market will be taken from Akuno and given to Okoro. Yes. May the gods forbid. May the gods forbid. If Okoro becomes a king, the whole community will be ruined. His reign will be a reign of terror. What are you still doing? I'm not going to do that. I'm tired. Let us sleep here for the night. We have the lions here. Let us rest for the night, please. I'm tired. Let us sleep here for the night, please. I'm tired. Let us sleep here for the night, please. I'm tired. I am confident that you are there and that you will fight this battle for me. Father. 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 Akuna. Akuna, my son. I've seen how much you have been struggling to keep up with the task ahead of you. The fault is not yours, but don't cry anymore. Go back to the hunt. I will do something before the time expires. I will direct you to a helper.
What is this? Thank you, young man, for saving my life. Who are you? I am Elu. I am your father's spiritual guide. I looked after him whilst he lived. You are Akuna Oduze, is it not? Yes. For being Oduze's son, I will help you. I can see that you are in dire need of external help. How do you know? <laughs> my son, nothing can be hidden under my roving eyes. Why were you fighting there? It was a spiritual battle. That apparition that assumed many forms is the embodiment of forces of darkness against light. But light always wins. I don't understand. You cannot understand. The source of your problem is your blood. My blood? Your blood, yes. How? Oh, it will be very dangerous to reveal it to you. What you need is guidance. And for that, you can depend on me. Check me when, whenever you are ready. Where do I find you? This is Abani Forest, isn't it? Yes. My home is in Eket Forest. When you get there, you will find a very big baobab tree. Immediately after that baobab tree, you turn to your right. Then you will find a small hut. But Holy One, I am in a precarious situation right now. If I cannot find a lion's head in a few days' time, I will lose my right to ascend the throne of Amudo. I see. Well, I will help you. But I need instant help. I need instant help, Holy One. Holy One, I need instant help. Help me! Help me! Go for the hunt. At this time of the night. Try to wait till tomorrow. I have to go now. How could I look go now? It's too late. Wait till the morning. More than now is the time for me to go. I have to go now. Now, may the spirit of your father and your forefathers go with you.
a month since we gave the specter to Akuna in search of the tribute to ascend the throne. We all know what our tradition says. It is not our fault. But if by the end of today he does not present us with a tiger's head or a lion's head, then the red matches will be handed over to Okuru. Then you will have the possibility of becoming king or ruining the chances of your family. Have I spoken well? Yeah. Well, yeah. Well, yeah. Well, yeah. Well, yeah. Well, yeah. They say my husband. That I will be giving the red matches tomorrow morning. Hey! 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 On the verge of being hey! Mom. Yes. I don't want to hey! my hey! husband. Hey! Hey! Listen, 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 listen. Hey! It is one thing to have an opportunity, mm. another to make use of it judiciously. Well, mm. how do I get a lion's head? <laughs> you see, that was why I blamed you to have allowed Akuna's lion's head to have fallen into Yenin Abyss. It would have been yours. Nay, this is no time to apportion blames. Just tell me how to get a lion's head, period. Can you trace the place and spot where Akuna's lion's head fell into? Yes, but that would be a waste of precious time. I did not say you should do it. Oh, Gary, my brother is there. After all, his stay in this village is because of me. Yes. Hey, man. <laughs> so, he will do anything I bid him do. Yes. He will assist you. Hey! hey. 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 My husband. <laughs> 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 Take it. But be careful. Much opposition is behind you. But I have always promised to be by your side. Thank you, Holy One. Thank you, Holy One. Thank you.
Not the sound of Ikoro who I'm hearing. Who is disturbing the sleeping lion? Who is checking the rock or teeth? Nena has a tight security around her. But you have been with her for so long. You know her shadows. You know when there's little or no security around her. 
people get it. Act fast and make good use of your head. Thank <laughs> you. 
I came to see how you preserve the head. Yes, that's just what I'm doing. Yeah. How are you doing it? Well, I mix some local gin with the lion's head and them. Um, now I'm using the leaves to cover it for the preservation. Mm. Yes, I've added more scent leaves to present, uh, the, I mean, to prevent insects and other flies getting to Oh, I will do that right away. When he brought the problem to the world before you, don't try to kill your brother, because he is the heir to the throne. The time will show to come. Just wait for it. I think that's okay. Any one of you? 
that will lead us to the arrest of the perpetrators of this gruesome act. Go and inform the village. Tell them that anyone that leads us to finding the killers of my daughter will be conferred with the highest title in the village and made a member of the Council of Elders. I have spoken. Yes! Go! 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 He has to see the king. He is an exile. He cannot see the king. It's important that he does. He has important information about the killers of Princess Nena. Then you wait. Let me inform the king. Okay. Make sure that you see him. You must see him. Don't worry. You must. Because I told you that you will come back to this land. If you remember. And now you'll be back. Your Highness. Ogele, the exile is here. He wants to see you. Hmm? Ogele, in my palace. How did he come into my palace? Tell him I don't want to set my eyes on him. But your highness, he says it's important. He has important information concerning the murderers of Princess Nenna. Hmm? So just be letting me. Bring him in. Yes, Your Highness. Quick. Your Highness. Your Highness. Who are the killers of my daughter? Your Highness, you know that time when the people lost their king, their tradition has it that his successor must provide a lion head. His hair, Akona, not being able to provide a lion head, decided to bring a head of a princess. When they brought the head to the palace, I saw it and immediately recognized it as that of Princess Nena. Oh. What? You mean the people of Amudu kill Princess Nena? How can Amudu kill my daughter? What? God! Get the warriors! God! You're hungry! Go and inform the Council of Elders. Go now! Mr. Hyde. Okay. Fine. Are you sure of your information? Yes. Sure. Are you sure?
Yes. I've been thinking. What is this? Since the king has promised anyone with useful information about the death of his daughter, will be given the highest title of the land and made a member of Council of Elders. Don't you think I should go and tell him? Don't do it, my husband. You said you did not recognize the people. You don't have enough to prove who they are. Now, look at this. It's a royal bangle. This is enough clue to find out those who killed the princess. My husband, you know this thing is very difficult. The whole thing may bounce back on you. indeed come. Our queen is already here. Yeah. Now we are going to expect the brave Akuna. The hair apparent, our prince, he is coming in with the tribute.
The symbol you've just pinned in front of us, in front of Amudu, is not a symbol of peace. That is war! We thought you'd come in to share with us in this our moment of glory, but you come with a message of war! What is the problem? The most precious daughter of Olauku has been killed. Yeah. And the head taken away. We are reliable informed that somebody from this village did it and the head is here. Our king says that Amaudu should send back the head and the killer immediately or face a retaliatory fight. Are you sure? Yes. I am very sure. You are sure? Then produce the person here. Let us see the person, or oh, where he has kept the head. Can we see the contents of that pot? What effort? Wait, man. down the pot. No! The pride of my father?
We are going with the first, the content, and the killer. No! 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 Wait! Oh, no! Wait! Warriors of Alugu, this is a mystery to us. Um, we plead with you. Go back to your king. Ask him to hold on. Give us just two days. We shall unravel this mystery. And at the end, whoever is the murderer shall be handed over to you. Then we must go with the pot and the content. Findings from the Oracle. Leaders of our land. I consulted the Oracle today. Surprisingly, the Oracle was silent over this issue. Well, since the Oracle has not spoken, and we have just two days to come out with our findings, is there anybody here present? Who has any suggestion to make? We all saw the lion head when Akuna came back from his exploits. And he says he knows nothing how the tragedy mysteriously became a human head. I suggest that we ask the people of Alauku to bear with us a little longer. Um, this is a serious issue. We cannot release the prince just like that to them, or let them do their worst. We are not afraid of them after all. I agree with you, Majumo. I agree with you. We should not release our prince, Akuna, to them. And we must not relent in our effort at finding out who is pouring this shame on all of us. Truth is like smoke. It never hides. It doesn't hide. with the man whom Ogele alleged was the murderer. But Amudu pleads that they were not sure he's the one, that we should give them two days to do their finding. No. I can't wait. I can't wait. Now, add about your gun to your number. Go back and capture all the young girls of Amudu and bring them to me. Yes, yes, Your, your Highness! highness. Good. <laughs> 
Fathers are still alive, and I'm sure you will not die. Hmm? The spirit of your ancestors will certainly fish out whoever must have done this evil on us. Please, try and cheer up. Don't worry, brother. I will stand by you, no matter what it takes. What is the decision of the council of members? Whatever their decisions are. This kingship will never leave this family. I can assure you. When you become king, make sure that the great farmland by the stream is taken over from a corner. I want that from mm -hmm. <laughs> Where is he going? Oh. It's like he's trying to run away. Wait, 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 wait,
Warriors of Amudu, what can I do for you? The Council of Elders have instructed us to be guiding you. It has been alleged that you want to escape. That I want to escape? Yes! yes. Akuna, son of Oduze, the heir to the throne of Amudu, that I want to escape? Yes! yes. Let's go back to the village. Let's go! I promised to the world anyone that would come up with useful information leading to the arrest of the killers of Princess Nina, my daughter. Ogele has performed a bit. It is now my turn to fulfill my promise. As from today, you are hereby pardoned and recalled from exile. You are now honored with the highest title of the land, and you are therefore a member of the Council of Chiefs. Congratulations. In addition, you will be given a bag of cows. I thought someone would lead us to the sun. Yeah. Yeah. I'm all 
make a name, Uno. The problem we have today is a delicate one. It is a big puzzle. And the elders have been trying to put heads together to solve that problem. To unravel that mystery. It is well that you are all here. I now ask you, do you want to go to war with Aluku? No! 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 no, no, no. 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 Do you want to go to war? No! No! Then, what must be done? Our elders, since Akuna is responsible for the crime, let us peacefully hand him over to the Lauku warriors. Yes! So that the Lauku warriors can now release our sisters and our daughters back to us. Who is Yoku? My only we don't daughter. want war. My only daughter was kidnapped. Ah. Hmm. I want my daughter back. I want my daughter back. Because of one person, look at the number of people. Warriors of Alaku, what is the message from your king? Our king has sent us to inform you people that your missing daughters are with us in Alaku. But that they will be killed if within three days you fail to hand over the actual murderers of his daughter, Princess Nena. After which, you wait for your retaliation. <laughs> yeah. Since the bone of contention is here, let us hear him. Akona, today you stand accused of killing the princess of Alugu. You have also heard the voice of Amudu. You are the heir apparent to our throne. What do you say? Elders and people of Amudu, If handing me over will bring about the release of our girls being held in captivity in Aluku, then do it. I am ready to lay down my life for them to be set free. But let it be known this day to the people of Aluku and Amudo that I am innocent. It is only the king that can hand Akuna over to Alugu. Amudo has no king. Take this matter. and slap your brother Akuna on the chest. By so doing, you will be handing him over to Alugu to be killed. In the same way, you also become her.
want our daughters returned to us tomorrow morning and in good condition. We assure you, the elders and the people of Amudu, that you will get back your daughters in good condition. Mm -hmm. And will pass on the message to our king accordingly. Before the gods. Besides, he has royal blood running in his face. Oh, what losses are you talking about? What innocence? And what royal blood? blood? The royal blood must flow in my daughter's veins. Your Highness, I saw him clearly that night at Amor the palace when he brought out your daughter's head from his bag and put it in a pot behind the house. Yes, Your Highness. We all caught him with the head inside a pot. Did you hear that? If he was innocent. This village would not have handed him over. Take him away. No! Take him away. Move him. Take him away. Move him. Take him away. 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 Take him away.
So what has the Council of Elders decided to do? Uh, you see, we were all surprised at the speed with which you found the head of the lion. Ah, that was very good, very good of you. Yes. Uh, more so, the head is very old. Good. Uh, actually, the Council of Elders has decided to crown you tomorrow, since your brother is dead. <laughs> uh, by the way, Okoro, sir, I hope your father gave you the royal bangle, which you must present tomorrow as the second child. Um, that, that is the more reason why I've come to see you. Very good, very good, good. I lost the bangle in the river. Is it good? <laughs> what did you say? Mazin, you are highly respected in this country. Hey! And in the, in the, in the uh, uh, Council of Elders, I know you can influence their views. Tell them to crown me with or without the bangle. This is, this is my only chance. If I miss it, that will be the end of Odunza's lineage. Remember, my, my father was a very good friend of yours. Okoro, Sir. tradition is a sacred thing. You cannot change it overnight. Man! <laughs> There's nothing I can do about it. Please, Mazin, do it. Hey. You can do it for me now. You can do it. Please. Hey. Eh? Look, I will never forget it. If I become the king, I will reward you tremendously. Hey, I'm out of Kwane. Yes, I'm out of Kwane. Yes, where's Kwane? We are all gathered here today to crown Prince Okoro. The second son of our late king, as the king of Amodu, Okoro has procured and presented, according to tradition, the lion's head. After his elder brother Akuna had failed, the elders have decided that today's event be low key. This is as a result of unpleasant circumstances in which we find ourselves. Yeah. The coronation can now proceed. Yeah. Okoro is supposed to present the royal bangle as a second son before the coronation. Yeah. Yeah. You were not present at yesterday's meeting of the council. That decision has been taken care of. Yeah. Um, since Mazi Ndulue, the royal regent, is uh, indisposed, I will perform his function. I want to win it! Um, Major Joko. Let me have the paraphernalia.
ago. Yes, your father bought it from my father when he has no money. When my father was wretched, now I have money. I have come to retrieve it. No, you can only retrieve what he did not sell. But for this one, no way. Yes, I said this is our own land. I have come to take it back. You are now an elder in the village council. You are supposed to set pace for people to follow, not to come here and flex your muscle. Allow me to do my things in, in my own way. And those your ways shall fail you. Are you talking to King like that? Made you king. Take him. Take him. <laughs> I sent for you and you did not come. What was the problem? Okay, leave this compound now. Leave this compound now! Listen. Hmm. I hope you can hear me. I am now your husband. I am now your husband. My brother is dead and he needs someone to take care of you. Okay, I can never, ever be your wife. Are you talking to a king like Are that? You were king. Listen. The tradition and culture has handed you over to me. Hmm. The entire palace, the community, including you, are now my property. Okra, okay. are you okay? I can never, ever be your wife, Okra. Okay. I will never be your wife. Hey, come back here. I will never be your wife. You will suffer for this. I refuse over my dead body. I will never be your wife. You will suffer for this. Council of Elders has decided to banish her into the forest. There she will live like an outcast. Which forest? Woman! I have decreed. My words are law. I can go back by it. Then I will go with her. So be it. So be it! Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank God I have seen you. Uh-huh. That's all I've come to see you, sir. Uh -huh. I hope there is no problem. Huh? Is this something we can discuss here or do we go to my house? Tell me, what is it? I have this useful information that has been bothering me for quite some time now. Over the death of a princess in Nam. Don't tell me you know something about the death of the princess. No, no. It's not me directly, but my brother. Thank you, Emma. What is it? What is it? No. Yes. My brother has this useful information concerning the murderers of Princess Nana. But his wife has not allowed him to voice it out because of the fear of the king. How did he get to know about the murderers? How? Tell me. No, my brother told me mm. that when he was tapping inside the bush one early morning, he saw he had some screams. He saw two men struggling with a girl. 
they eventually killed her and cut off her head. Now, when they left the scene, my brother came to the scene and saw her lying. He noticed a bangle. He picked it up and left for home. Why did he not come out with this information since? Even when the king made a promise of an enticing reward? No, it's because of the fear of the king. Look, my brother, this news you have given to me now is very, very important. I was to go to somewhere else. I will even want us to go there. We will go there right away. I will be able to talk to him <laughs> because it is very important. <laughs> nice. <laughs> The king is gone to the land beyond, leaving the throne to the two of you. This is not a time to make enemies, but to come together and be strong. Divided we fall, united we stay. Let's come together as one family. Somebody help me ask them what they're fighting for. What are they really fighting for? Somebody help me and ask this two brothers. What are you really fighting for? God did not make a mistake at all. When he brought your brothers to the world before you. Don't try to kill your brother Cause he's the heir to the throne The time will surely come Just wait for it United we stand And divided we fall <laughs> Somebody asked his brothers what the fight and come to your family. Who has the tiger? Remains abomination. But today, 
It is just not bugging me. Come. Come on. Nobody can run away from me. Nobody. You are endangering the life of your husband. properties.
By the sword you kill the princess. And by the sword you shall die. The council of elders, in collaboration with the king, have unanimously decreed that you be beheaded and the head brought to the king. outside. He said he has something to tell the king and elders about this matter. Bring him in. Bring him. Your Highness. Your Highness. Elders of our land, I greet you all. I yeah, greet you too. Welcome. Yes. What information do you have? I came to inform you that Ogele, the man who died mysteriously, killed your daughter. What? I saw him while tapping. There were two of them. This bango fell from the other person while putting your daughter's head in his bag. Are you sure of what you are saying? Yes, your highness. Then why didn't you come up with this information? Oh, this why? I was not sure until his corpse was brought to the village square. Then I remember this remarkable scar on him. Your Highness, this is a royal bangle. And it can only be worn by members of the royal family. With this, it will be very easy to find a money. Bring me the suspect.
food is ready. Possible for the death of my daughter? No, Your Highness. I know nothing about the death of your daughter. Look. Look at this bundle. You know something about it? Yes, Your Highness. No, Your Highness. According to our tradition, a bangle is given to the second son on the event of the death of the king. That particular bangle was given to my younger brother when our father, the king, died. I was given this, this royal necklace. The your younger brother killed my daughter! I don't think so, Your Highness. What you think is not important. has no king yet. What? Okoro should step down immediately from the throne. 
we must present the royal bangle to the village. Failure to do that. Amudo will be a serious problem. What is it again? Elders and people of Amudo, I greet you. I am here representing the king of Alauku. He says I should inform you that the person you brought to him is not the murderer of his daughter. An eyewitness has revealed that the owner of this bangle is the killer of Princess Lin. He lost this bangle while killing our princess. What nonsense are you talking about? You heard me! Take it off! 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 Go back! Go back! You either produce the murderer to avoid bloodshed between our two villages. Or you face war, real war. Mm. If you want war, don't produce him. What about Akuna? Is he alive? Yes, he is. Hey. Hey. He's alive. Hey. My king says that he will be released to you immediately. You send the murderer, just like we did when we returned your daughters. Can I see that bangle? Yes. There it is. This bangle belongs to Amudu. It is the exclusive totem of our royalty. And you say that the owner of this bangle is the murderer? I am not just saying it. I'm not just saying it. The owner of that bangle is the killer of our princess. Produce him. War. Real war. Eldo Jimba, do not mistake our peace overtures as a sign of cowardice. You do not threaten us here. We do for the mere threat. We will go beyond threat if we do not produce the murderer. Amudu Kwan! Amudu Kwan! The lives of our people as human beings is being controlled by the gods. If the god says that Okoro should step down, then he must do so. The mystery of the bangle is traced to Okoro, and Okoro is the owner. Yes. Our lives as a people, we do not support or condone evil. Okoro should be released to Okoro and let them do what they like to do. Yes, my friend. Yeah. Yeah. The elders have reached a decision. The decision of the elders is the voice of Amodu. We call on our gods to witness what we are about to do here now. Let them judge fairly and dispassionately. 
Chief priest. Derobe him. No! I am the king! Oh, why do you find him? Oh! No! 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 So much has happened before you today, which you are not supposed to see. Yes. When you get back to your king, tell him that we want Akuna, our son, returned tomorrow morning yes. at the boundary. Yes. You will see him as long as we get our murderer. He will be there. Akuna. Yeah. Well, elders of our land, sons and daughters of Amodu, I greet you all. It is now clear that that old lion head, which Okoro presented as the custom demanded, was not his. That lion head was procured by Akuna. Yeah. Our elders say that he that the gods must destroy the first make mad. Akuna, therefore, still remains the heir to our throne. Yes. Therefore, tomorrow morning, we shall all troop out a mass to the boundary to receive our king. One last thing, you warriors, you will all go to the forest, seek, and bring back to us the queen and our king's mother. Amu the queen! Yeah! Where's the winner? Yeah! Take him out of here! Bring him! <laughs> no, you can't take him!
treatment we have given to this man it was as a result of misjudgment my illustrious king king okeke asked me to beg for your forgiveness he also asked me to ask you or to inform you or to beg you that you should continue the coexistence the peaceful coexistence that has been between our two villages we greet you once more. Mm -hmm. Here is your son. salute him that the people of Amudo that we salute him we thank him um, we shall continue to live we thank you
I had decreed with my council of elders that whoever would be found guilty of killing my daughter would be killed. However, because of your pleadings and the relationship that existed between your father and my palace, decided to temper justice with my son. Right. Your brother Koro despite the fact that he killed my daughter. We handed over to you. Alright. Thank you very much. Yes, Your Highness. Your wicked deeds have strained the beautiful relationship that existed between this village and your village. There wouldn't have been any reason you would have been killed. But for your brother, King Akuna, because of his pleadings and supplications, is an embodiment of real love. That sort of love that is so rare among human beings. In spite of all your malevolence, he still wants you to leave. I have decided to borrow a lift from him. I've forgiven you. Thank you very much, King KK. You are great, and your reign will continue to be blessed. Thank you. Your ancestors will give you another loving daughter. Yes, sir. I lack words to express my gratitude and happiness. In appreciation of your goodwill and love, I wish to hand over to you the Amudu parcel of land between Uda River and your boundary. May God continue to bless your reign. And once again, thank you very much. Sorry for the all the troubles I've caused you. I know I don't deserve mercy. Please forgive me. I'm terribly sorry. Your Highness. Thank you for sparing my life. I'm sorry. Okoro, 
You are my brother. You are my blood. You will always be my brother. I forgive you. Try to kill your brother 